Uh, number one is abundance of land. You don't talk about Nyerere land in Africa. We do have abundance of arable land. Africa is the second largest continent in the world. It constitutes 22% of the world's area. Did you know the United States of America, Yosef, the whole of Europe, India, China, Argentina, New Zealand, Mukazi, Batari, Zinofita, Zinofita, Africa. That's how big it is. It is uh, uh, over a billion people. <clears throat> it is a giant to record when it comes to Nyaya, Yekura, number three, right? Okay? There's abundance of mineral resources, fertile soils. You go to Mozambique, Zimbabwe, Malawi, Nigeria, Burundi, Cameroon, the whole of Africa. The whole of Africa, except of course the deserts. But uh, abundance of, of natural resources. Uh, did you know DRC itself, it has uh, enough water resources to generate electricity for the whole of Africa? That's DRC. Did you know that even Tanzania has more gold? It has more gold than South Africa. Tanzania. They are sitting on gold. You talk about Zimbabwe, Wabutarisa. Gomoriaria ma range iripoe the great directors musana we se uya uya musana we se uya we 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 makomo ya pasa spacho pane ufumi pane ufumi glorisa pane ufumi glorisa and so this this is what we have gold diamonds natural gas you know platinum uranium and all these things in in Libya with oil. In, also in Chad, in Angola, in Nigeria, Libya yoga, in ma oil reserves, akakwana to supply the whole of Africa. So the, this is what we have. And we have also predictable climate, right, in Africa. Uh, our climate is exceptional because we know Nguwe no ya winter chandu, Nguwe no ya summer tme siwa, there is abundance of sunshine, karatika taorinye ma blackouts, in Africa, I think we see you in the nick. But you move around, I'm not getting. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Because you need to make nick. Vano, vano, one as well for three hours, four hours. Three point one hour. So, 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 you, you get the point. You talk about the breathtaking beauty of Africa. Tikatawa shakawanda. You talk about, you know, the mama, ma forests, mama, the fruit trees. You know, indigenous uh, fruit trees in Africa. You can grow. They they are saying you can grow any kind of fruit in Africa. You can grow any kind of fruit in Africa. But here is the enigma. What is a Jose is Jose? Jaka is one man. Jaka fake one man. More Africa. Then you shift your eyes now. What is a Samanje? Shiriman Dutch. This is where the enigma is. What is a Shiriman Dutch? Africa is the face of poverty, disease, and suffering. This is where the the need mice, right? No, Sakavana out the Zira Bana CNN, but a BBC, the Mamma Man, you know, news agencies, but a doctor is a Teresa Munanen Zara, Arab Fan Zara, Munezi Were, Munan Tambura, Arimu Rombo, no Isa, no Rita Wosho. That is the face of Africa. Africa is a leader in negative statistics, the most un underdeveloped uh, continent on planet Earth. Uh, uh, and it is a dumping ground foot of second hand anything that you can talk about. Second hand anything. Yes, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> then no testing ground, you have deadly weapons of, of, of warfare. It is the most divided continent in terms of tribalism. Tribalism is serious, it's ingrained in Africa. Regionalism, ethnic cleansing, but ethnic wars, Iwondo, Zoka, Zoka. Come to Africa. You come to Africa, it is the hotbed, it is known as the hotbed of corruption, characterized by financial scandals, power intoxication, and hedonistic indulgence. 
You come to my, 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 my mother continent, Africa. This is where the indictment is. This is where the enigma is. These are the seven Ds of Africa. Debt, spirit, drug, disease, dependence, disequilibrium, disaster, and death. And then there are images of Africa. There are images of Africa <coughs> in the minds. These, these are perceptions. My perceptions. I can't be one of them. is Africa. Of course, Vasco da Gama was the first one to say it's a dark continent. I have a few questions. It's a retarded continent. No, I'm but I was with Maria Chinna and I was fighting and I just said, Trillions upon trillions. So it's a retarded continent. Then, of course, Ibori, I can go uh, I, I this one, this one, this one is, uh, is a Portuguese author. I know a book that can't see Dos Absconticas. I tell you, I'm so Africa with you. It is a continent. You got your squad of my Mariwai. Where I see where you go, as Mariwai. Mariwai show as Africa. Africa. Aka Aka Vatis. Aka Sia Aka Jaze. Aka Saka Chichi. Dos Abscoticas. Right. And then Arab boy, you remember? Arab boy. Yeah, okay. Aka 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 Spoke a lot of debate. Aka Chichi. Africa is a bleeding continent, and he likened Africa to that woman. When by the Akanga Island, it's a rope. It's bleeding, right? And then Alfred Tenson, Ndia Akaga, Akaga, Chifiri Mchiachia, Chifiri Mchiachia, Kanzi, Children of a Lesser God. Children of a Lesser God. I don't put this up, but you know, Africa, Lana, 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 Simba. You get the point? And then Donald so, uh, Trump, you, you remember recently, I got Africa is a shit war, shit war, Zola Chamber, right? Right? It's a shit war, it's a shit war. And uh, you also touch the storm. I can vat you. Now, prove me wrong. All right, okay. Yeah, I can prove me wrong. If you are not a shit war, so prove me wrong. Now, that's what can you do? What can you do? Like my Putin, I got this symmetry. Don't go fear. Don't go fear. I don't know if you are my queen, I don't know if you are my friend. You can feel that it's a cement, the beauty that I got you. As a chance, I don't know if you are my friend, I don't know if you are my friend. Right? You get the point. These are the images of Africa. And now, there are theories that are being advanced to explain the African enigma. The first theory. You might want to go to three churches in Africa. Three churches. With all this abundance of resources, Jesus, but you are not a large show, la rompo, Jacob, no kiss a pass pass. That means the Koran theory, second, the first theory, but not you. It is because of uh, uh, colonialism. We talk about what you are because of that. So Africans are generally timid, they are afraid to think and afraid to do. Africans are not producers of all original thought. But the repeaters of other people's thoughts. Mm -hmm. But now the question is India was once a colony, China was once a colony, Brazil was once a colony, United Arab Emirates, Yakanga in colony, Korea, Yakanga in colony. But now, she changed against Chagatika Africa, she snapped with Tika, who needs Winnika, Zagambo, Zagambo colonizers. So, Snuka Jabachina with you, Nyaya Choka. It is beyond Nyai colonialism. Right. Are we together? <clears throat> There's another theory <clears throat> that is being advanced. What he, he, he claims it. What Africa is the hottest. Kuno Pisa is running a repo. And so Africans have cooked the brains like an omelette. They, 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 they have cooked the brain. Remember, guys, it's one before uh, so, but now the question is, there are Africans who are excelling in various fields in academics, in sports, in business, etc. Joto Shamisa. Africa. Now, the question is, how did the African sun miss them? That is the question. And so, that theory, to know now to you, we can raise a lot of questions. And then, number three, why not you for why not advance a religious reason? Why not you? Uh, Africans are descendants of Ham. 
who was cursed. But, but the Bible does not support that notion. Because in Genesis chapter 10, verse 6, the Bible says, the sons of Ham were Cush, which means black. Are we together? Cush. Or Ethiopia in, Bible, in the Bible, it means black. What was up, Wakada? Misrael. Dio waka 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 sura ma Egyptians. Put. Dio waka waka beri Kabalians. Then Canaan. Dio waka beri Kamakinians. Now in Genesis chapter nine verse twenty five, we are told Ziva niaya ya no iya yokuwa tapa. Ashipeni nuka pakuwa pake unotio case the B Canaan. Are we together? A servant. A, a, a servant of servants. You are going to be a servant to your brothers. Cast the bee, Kenna. He did not say, Cast the bee, Kush. First born, he said, Cast the bee, Kenna. And it is true, as we explore the Bible, with the Canaanites indeed. Bakashipakuna Satan, and they were cast. You are going to be Joshua. Karazaho was a Canaanite. Kush was not cast. Kush was not cast. But unfortunately, Tiamata or Nia Tupa. The Kushites were not cursed. They were not cursed. We're not in the Bible. Amen. We're not cursed. Saka, that theory. I shan't hear you. They were not advanced. Like we feel one or two or Africans are what they are because of the type of education they have. One. Africans are not producers of original thought, but repeaters of what others have thought. Their education system promotes a memory, memorization, and repetition, not critical thinking. So they get an A for remembering when Livingstone came to Africa. They get a, a, a degree for narrating the process of the Second World War. What see? Something that has nothing to do with it. So that they get an A, they are degree, what to put gown, what to march, what to march, and they march into poverty. Right? March into poverty. Right? Second, what about some sort of education system? All right, it's all, it's okay. No, no, it's no fuma, it's no fuma in But now, let's briefly look at the biblical argument. Just five points that I want to, uh, you know, five asset, assertions. That I want to raise when you have the biblical, you know, argument, right? From Sorbinyai. The first concept that I want to explore briefly is the head concept. Then, secondly, the one piece of lead concept. And then, thirdly, the origin of nations or races concept. Then, fourth, uh, that's prominent Africans in the Bible. Then, the fifth one, Africa is God's backup plan. Are you getting the point? Mm -hmm. Right? This is the biblical argument. This is the biblical argument. And then, of course, we go now to the Pesilatabjas application. Yeah. First, the headship concept. Now, Acts chapter 17, verse 26, to is what we'll say. Bible says here, and he made from one blood, mm -hmm. which is Adam, every man, nation of man, at a man, to dwell on the face of the earth, and has determined. Their pre appointed times and boundaries of their dwellings. But no other line, he met all men, all nations from how many? One blood. One. Are you getting the word? So, in other words, when God created Adam, when God created Adam, yes, when God fashioned Adam, the Bible says he created all men in Adam. So he created the Europeans in Adam, the Caucasians. He created the Indians in Adam. He created the Kushites, the black people in what? The Chinese in what? Are you getting the point? In Adam. They were in Adam's loins. If we had, if we had time, we would go to Hebrews chapter 7, verse 9 and 10. You will notice they were in Adam's loins when Adam was created. So Adam Baga Tadza, Aga Jamuti, Aka Rogwa, three days ago. Aka Rogwa, I want you to know, so I don't know what you're doing. Chaki. Yes, I don't know what Are you getting the point? So, 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 so now, so what we say about China, put it, there is no difference. Ah, Panam Siago, Pacati Pemu, 
Mushaina, no moon, Mutema, until the Bible regarded as a We came from Adam. Some sanitary serpents. You get the point? That's why the Bible says, For in Adam all die. You get the point? And it says, Therefore, just as one man sinned, entered into the world, death spread to all men because all men sinned. They sinned away in Adam. Why? They were in Adam's loins. The reason why we die. It is because we are part of Adam's project. Mm. Are you getting the point? Mm. We are part of Adam's project. That one is a distinctive mark. You put it. Right? So, the second one is the one piece of land concept. The Bible says in Genesis chapter 1, verse 9 and 10 says, And the Lord said, Let the water. <coughs> Under the sky be gathered into one place and let dry ground appear. Underline that one. Let dry ground appear. And it was so. And God called it the dry ground land and gathered waters. He called seas. And God saw that it was good. Let the dry ground appear. One piece of land. Now, scientists have discovered. We have a question from Francis Bacon, a uh, from Alfred Wigner. We have a question from the world medical intelligence. We have a question from the world medical intelligence. We have a question from the world medical intelligence. We have one piece of land. Are we together? Okay. Okay. Yes. Genesis chapter 1, you have to write let the ground appear. Okay. It's one piece of land concept of the Bible. Now, I want you to see, right? Mm -hmm. Scientists have discovered that you know, the, the, our planets are sitting on plates, what they call the te techno, uh, tectonic plates. They are sitting on plates like that. But now, Ukadamba Chinese, like for instance, here. Yeah. Oh, 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 all right, okay. Why don't you show, why don't you show that one now? I'm not using my computer. It's never my computer now. Oh, oh, but Jehuta is an idiot. I'm going to, I'm going to, that super continent. Now, you will notice when Russians come out with you, but continents are yakas of them, none Africa, yakas of them. The Bible is very clear when it talks about the flood, Mumbai and all, it uses a tectonic language. You get the point? The Bible uses tectonic language. chapter 7, verse 11. You know, all the fountains of the great drip were what? Broken up. And the windows of heaven were what? Open. The Hebrew word, the broken up, which is bagger, is used in the Old Testament passage to refer to geologic phenomena of faulting. Okay. Are you getting the point? Okay. Right? Saka mvura baya simuka, mwara vura, ma mafatitera udenga, vura chikuda, nepa zasi. That same one piece of land, you know, they had seven cup. Right? Are we together? Are you getting the point? That's the bad concept. Now, no doubt you show the banana. Genesis chapter 10, verse 23, 25. You know, to you, Abba were born two sons. The name of one was Pele. For in his days, the earth was what? Divided. So it was during the time of Peleg. Are you getting the point? Mm -hmm. That the earth was what? Divided. divided. All right. The earth was now divided fully. Mm -hmm. My continents, S, Akalapo, during that time. Dopagaita, the global continental drift. Otherwise, it was one piece of what? Land. Yaka city, Wamunumungari? One. Akata Kuramaruzi, oh? Awesome. awesome. This is the biblical argument. Are you getting the point? Right. right? Now, <clears throat> I want us to get to the origins of, of races. Panel. Right? Quickly, because of our time. Now, you will notice if you read Genesis chapter 10, in the Tukulisira Pachena, Wanawaka Vakona Noah. Right? There were three Japheth, Shem, Nani, Naham. Three. <laughs> Pana, 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 Japheth, no pana, pana, Caucasians, the, the, the Europeans, as we know them. Verse 22 in Genesis chapter 10, no pana, 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 Shem, no pana, pana, Semites, no pana, pana, Jude, Jews, no pana, pana, Arabs. You remember, I'm Arabs, I don't pana, Ishmael, are we together? Right? 
right? My servants, my Judans, my servants, right? Then Panaham, no part of Ia Veseta Veringa, Misra, no part of Egyptians, put Babawa Manipians, Kush, that's Ethiopia, which means Black African. Mm -hmm. Are we together there? Mm -hmm. Right? So, what is the difference? The difference is only in the pigment. Yeka, in Uunza Kana, Iripas, space skin, melanin, and cotton. The skin pigment, that skin pigment is responsible for color. You get the point? So, 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 Maraka was just because I can't say so, so, because I don't push, push, but I divide what? This super continent, but I divide what? This piece of land, push, a China Kunzimbo, in Opisa Sula. Are we together? A China Kangana, Nesuare Paikwet. Okay. Are you getting the point? Sakagamush, Akamus, Akada. You get the point? So, so that's it. In the only method, you know, Pisa, Sakakune Mino, who did a Fena movie. Are you getting the point? Sakana, I eat my skin cancer. Mamma, what are you doing? Palabamuno. Zukura sells her bono. Why one of Zurama King Nama King? Are you getting the point? Mm. But he should take a pure of his skin naturally. Mm. So we, we need to love ourselves as we are. Amen. And accept ourselves as we are. So, don't you know, The fourth biblical argument, right? Uh, you, you look at the prominent people in the Bible. The first one, of course, is Nimrod, son of Cush. You remember? Mm. The Tower of Babel. Mm -hmm. You get the point. 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 You the point. You get the point. But now, you get the the point. You get the point. You the the Mm. Project here, yeah, I think I'm going to move on to the son of Cush, right? Now, Zipporah, Mukazwa, wa Moses, Munorangaria, Nyaya Panama, Numbers chapter 12, verse 1 to 4, uh, for Miriam and Aaron, Vakasora, Vakapopo Terra Moses, so I got one, 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 Mukush, one, 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 Mukush. Are we together then? Right? Saka, Zipporah, Zipporah. Aka 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 betsera na na Moses mutunga mi wake aka betsera. Then you talk about Jethro, babala eh, babala Zipporah. Kure au chache shara wa Moses. So ndo aka uya ne niaya ya that leadership leadership concept ye delegation. Tiri pamoja. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Watch advice and watch only. You talk about a bad Malik the Ethiopian. Jeremiah can do one. Mugomba, he bet me like the Ethiopian, the black man, the other one, 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 the then the Ethiopian eunuch, the minister of finance, the way of Robert Stone and Philip, and you see black people, one more, one more, one more, one more, Papa Saramai. So, can God use Africans, Papa Saraki? Yes. The answer is yes. We are not in the Bible, in God's hand. Are you getting the point? Mm -hmm. Right? This is the biblical argument. The other argument, I told about and I, is Africans, <clears throat> right? Is Africa is God's backup plan. You notice that Abraham Baba Kutenya. Why Mukatinekenan Bible did not know Pagaita F Great Femai? Pagita Great Femai, Abraham Akadzika, Akaina Egypt, Akaina Egypt. Satan White Chaka Uraya Abraham, Nesha Yamuchuno Chak, and she is Ayam Chuno Chaka Motosiva, Mozia Messiah, Tiriba Wajan. But now, Africa proved it to be a better plan for God. Pangwayo. Jacob and his family, once again, Satan of Abraham, and they found themselves in Africa. Genesis chapter 42, verse 40, uh, chapter 42 to 45. Moses was educated in, in Egypt, that's in Africa. Acts chapter 7, verse 22. Now, Mumuaj, you remember Pakabere, Herod, 
Achaka kuburaya mwana Baibiru kuli sapati nao To the angel Gabriel Akaraya Joseph na Mary Kuti watore mwana Baibiru ku Africa Muripo ya mwana mwana Right now, now it's Africa Africa Whenever there are challenges Zaganangana Ne plani yopone yo soko wana Africa becomes God's what? They can plan. Are we together then? Did you know the Seventh-day Adventist Church, as we speak right now, over 60% of the membership of the Seventh-day Adventist Church is in Africa? Amen. Are you getting the point? And because of that representation, division atafunga, jaranga funga, achipas, and achisina support the Africa. Did you know that? Achipas. They have to canvas it for Africa first. Because no, they more than 60%. Yeah, that's a lot. So, the Seventh day Adventist church is, is, is quickly becoming an African church. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. Are you getting the point? Mm -hmm. So, it's high time right now. It's high time for us to wake up. Mm -hmm. It's high time for us to wake up and make a contribution to the world church. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you get the point? Mm. We have to make a contribution mm. because the, the, the biggest chunk of our membership is here in Africa. Right? Now, so this is the practical argument now. Over 60% of the total church membership is in Africa. Africa is regarded as a reservoir of untamed natural resources. Right? When we went to Jordan, I was sent by Dr. Absosha. Did you want to? Jordan, what kind of churches and Doka Kataka Pindu no Israel? Yes, it's drip irrigation. Are we together there? How they have turned the desert into a paradise. Amen. Dr. Absolute says to me, You know what? One very little rain, Yavana, very little water, Yavana. What you ask your package say is Africa, we need to share with the world the secret of our poverty. Because she knows the Chakalans. Mm. You get the point? Mm. We need to share with the world the secret of our poverty. Mm. Because we are a reservoir of untapped natural resources. And that's why the Chinese are coming. Mm. Is the Chitina of diaspora? You want to tell the Diaspora in North Africa. Mm. <laughs> because in Spanish, like Singapore, you get the point. This is where the problem is. It is a reservoir of human capital development. The community concept, we can only get it in Africa. This is not decide, plus you know, say, you know, it's communist. Yes. Yes. I'll live as a community. Mm. And we can write books about this. Mm. You get the point? Now, what is the problem with Africa? Mm. There is nothing wrong with an African mind. mind. The problem is with our what? Mindset. Mindset. Mm. Or world view. Mm. That is where the problem is. Right? I'm not going to... Um, I will not belabor you on explaining what a worldview is, but in we'll brief, when we talk about a worldview, we are talking about the interpretive framework in the umwe in the umwe whether we like it or not. It's like uh, you are putting on lenses, uh, a blue, blue, green, green, subconscious mind, no more framework as you know the world of you. Sakapune is the African world of you. Ma one no ejin e moon we Africa. Moon tema. Saka now, mucha wana kuti opana. Atau shandra moon tema. If you want to win it, right? Hey, you look at him subconscious. No more world of you. Three four eleven one one. Right? It is the world of you that defines belief systems. Ideas, feelings, and values. Mm -hmm. Right? And it is now the belief system, ideas, feelings, and values that define visible behavior. Mm -hmm. 
That's the visible behavior. Mm. But that visible behavior is being informed by my value system. The moon, the belief system. Mm. That belief system is informed by the world. Mm. So if you want to change the African, uh, you don't you don't concentrate on most of our concentration is on that. Is, is on that. Mm. Hey, okay, try for color. They are just looking at the visible behavior. Mm -hmm. Are you getting the point? Mm -hmm. And and as you get serious, you know, for that they need to be All right. Are you getting the point? Mm -hmm. yeah. As you get serious, you have to go deep into the world of an African to to change the mindset. In it, something I want to put more on board. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm full.
We see opportunities, we explore opportunities. Tinaita Shakanaka, even when we do, we venture to business. Tinaita, she snatches no pony. Tell it as a man. Sakamarina at Pomona, at Tinaita Shakanaka, no singer, amen. Amen.